everyone, this is Shishi coming on to share with you on AliExpress haul. So I have some Christmas themed dies that I got in from the sale. And I thought I would come on and share with you the dies. So I have this cute bell. It's a double bell. It looks great on cards. I could put it like a little rhinestone or something in the center of this bow. You can even fill in some of the parts that are cut out and make it more interesting. Change the color of the ribbon or bow. So many possibilities. Okay, so that's the first one. The next one, and there's one similar to this one, uh, but I got this one instead. It's a Merry Christmas, like Christmas tree, and it comes in several parts, so I don't know if you like that. I know the other one I saw was one piece, but um, it cuts out like this, so it can look like a Christmas tree, but the whole die looks like this, okay? So that's how it looks. Um, you could probably use the Merry Christmas as a standalone sentiment like this without the topper. So that's cute too. So a lot of possibilities with this one. Um, you can change the colors. Um, it's really up to you. You could probably just use this part um, for other things other than Christmas. Just as a decoration on your card. So I got that one. So really fun. And the next one is this happy birthday. It looks like this. I don't know if I got this one already. This looks so familiar. But I may have two. I don't know. But anyway, here it is. It came in. And it's like some music or something. This just... I have so many happy birthday dies. I don't know which, what I've already like have in my stash and what I don't. But um, hopefully this is the only one I have but I just like the way it looked it's just really pretty and elegant so there's that um, the next one is this star circle it comes with the stitch circle die as well as this die that cuts into the paper so how I got this look is I cut it out in white first and then I cut it out in gold and then I used, oops, sorry, this part right here to make the frame so that it looks like that. So, yeah, this one does not cut out around the circle. It just cuts like into the paper. I hope that makes sense. So that's how you can get it to look like this. You don't have to cut it out like three times or make three different cuts. Okay, the next one is this like eyelet scallop edge rectangle set. It's a good price and I like the big scallops. I also like tiny scallops too. I just like these style dies. I'm looking for the square if they have a square. Um, I don't know, but I, I really liked how this one turned out. So if you see the square, let me know and I would like to buy it if you find the link. But here is that. All right, um, next are these cross stitch dies that I really love. And thank you to that subscriber who told me where the ovals were. I have those on order. But um, this one can be like a snow globe topper or you can make it into a fish bowl. So really love this set and it has the cross stitching going around it. That's what I really love. I'm looking for squares. So I have this style, the stars, the hearts. I got the uh, circles and the ovals are on order and I'm looking for the square set. If anybody sees that, let me know. And I believe I do already have the rectangles. So it's just hard to keep up with you know that style and and so on but um, I appreciate uh, the ladies that comment on my channel and help me out and finding things like tags um, another um, 
subscriber had told me about some tags I was looking for and I do appreciate that so here is some rectangle um, I'm sorry a square type dies with a pretty border so I cut one out in purple so you can see it comes in a set of three and they're just so pretty you can layer them together like that or you can make it you can angle it like this on a card or project I just really like the I, I guess you can call it lacy or filigree work going around the square it's just so pretty so I got that set and the last set I want to share it's like 10 tags these are great for um, labels if you want to add brads to your sentiments or if you want to attach them to gifts you can you know use that method um, these are like more like label dies these two and then these are like tiny tags to attach to your small gifts and I have like really small sentiments that I can stamp on there and layer so that's the set this one looks like an ornament you can make that into an ornament if you want and here's another style I have a, a nice um, die cutting machine now that does um, pressure on fabric so you know cutting this out in leather would be kind of cool or that faux you know that faux leather type material so anyway I just thought I'd share with you this set of 10 tags really really nice set okay alright so that is my share for today I hope you found it helpful and um, again this one right here this is an A2 size card so this is how the rectangle fits on there so it's not quite A2 size but it it layers nicely all right so links will be in the description box below I will be back with more videos of different dies that I will be getting in I got some alerts on my email that my order has arrived to the destination country or something so hopefully something else will be coming in this week so thank you for joining me take care and have a fabulous day